April 20th. Let's read the scripture first. This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Psalm 118.24 Glory in his holy name. Let the hearts of those who seek the Lord rejoice. Look to the Lord and his strength. Seek his face always. 1 Chronicles 16.10-11 I am the vine, you are the branches. If a man remains in me and I in him, he will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. John 15, 5. To him who is able to keep you from falling and to present you before his glorious presence without fault and with great joy. Jude, verse 24. This day of life is a precious gift from me, treated as the treasure it is by prayerfully prioritizing. As you look into the day that stretches out before you, seek my face to help you discern what is most important. Set priorities according to my will and use them to guide you as you go along your pathway. This practice will help you make good choices about the use of your time and energy. When you reach the end of the day, you can feel at peace about the things you have done and also the things you have not done. I encourage you to invite me into everything you do. The briefest prayer, help me Lord, is sufficient to involve me in your activities. I delight in your acknowledgement that you need me continually. And I want you to delight in your neediness for it is a strong link to my radiant presence. Although living in a dependent mode is countercultural. It is a blessed way to live, rejoicing in the glory of my presence. Praise the Lord.